Welcome back to Sight Tech and your Mountain Earthworks training videos. In this video, I wanted to quickly talk about something that's a little confusing on if my machine is accurate or not based on GNMS precisions. Just like in a rover where you can see the horizontal and vertical precisions, the Earthworks machines have a menu here that if you go down into the system settings, that has one that says GNMS precision tolerance. Most of the time, they're always set to medium, but there's confusion on what is fine course and medium mean? Does that mean that my machine's only been accurate to a medium? Or, hey, if I put it on course, is my machine going to act better? Dozer grader, ex excavator, whatever it is, is it going to be, oh, I'm going to grade within that tolerance? No. It's kind of confusing. So one thing to first look at is throughout the day, depending on if you have full constellations or not, or if your base does, what you can do is hit the tablet with the gear, go to system status, and you can check for your left and right receivers what you're currently at. So if you touch and go in here for your left receiver, which is your dominant one, there's your at the moment right now current precisions. Vertical is seven huns, horizontal is at two hundredths. 14 satellites, which means either my base or my machine is not sending out all constellations because we haven't got that set up. Not a big deal if you're low on satellites, but just Right there, all of a sudden, everything's back down to 700s and 200s. So what this does mean is that's what your current precisions are. If you've ever got that orange bar at the very top that says your set tolerances are out of those tolerances, it's usually because you've broken out of what it's set on. And if we go back into that setting that I was in a minute ago, which is your GNS precisions, this means that on horizontal right here, when my machine breaks outside of 0.15 horizontally and 0.15 vertically, I'm going to get that ribbon at the top that says, hey, your set tolerances are outside of those precisions. Your machine is not within that. So if you set this to hort to coarse or to fine, it doesn't mean your machine's going to grade any better or you pick more satellites up or anything like that. It means that those tolerances on the screen are going to warn you when you've broken, broken outside of that. So guys that are finished grading with graders or dozers, if you're on your last passes, sometimes what you can do is put it on fine. And all of a sudden, if you're outside of that tolerance, that 0 0.10, which is outside of an inch, you're all of a sudden going to have a warning that comes up, which would tell you, hey, you're not close to what you were grading a little bit ago. You're out of that. So they can stop and wait for things to regain, um, get away from trees, buildings, whatever it is. So it doesn't make your machine better, but it, it's a warning. So let's say you're working next to a building or under some trees that um, make it to where your 0.15 is just not good enough. You can put it on course. Or you can go into the web interface and actually change those numbers to a higher number, whatever you need to do to be able to still use the machine. The other thing you can do is each one of these menus has a little eye in the corner right there. This is going to give you a little information on kind of what I was just saying right there about your GNS precision error limits don't take account for measure ups like that. But just be aware of what that is and don't be misunderstood that my machine is only cutting medium. No, it's still cutting what it's cutting no matter what. But just knowing your menus, knowing all this stuff is is really, really key. So thanks for watching this video from Site Tech Inner Mountain, Earthworks training videos on your precisions in your machine.